Anyways, now we get to go into this, uh, spooky area. A body race bomb. Over. Barry? Monster. James. Gun. Ineffective. It's dead. Stay away. Or is it outside the mansion? Stay. Hey. You mean where I am right now? No thanks. Actually, forget what the puzzle here is. <laughs> you think Luis would be a dog person? I don't actually know. I think I remember this. I don't remember the solution exactly, but I think I remember this puzzle. That was not what I wanted. Let me see what I did. So I, I legitimately do not remember this the solution to this puzzle. I just I have a hunch based on looking at it. Maybe the gate will open when the guard's dog's desires are fulfilled. Um, the last gasps of destruction. The war cry of revenge. Maybe they're meant to be facing, like, north and south. Or east. Okay, well, let me think. So, it's war. Inscription reads, the war cry of revenge. Inscription reads, the last gasps of destruction. Let me let me move my mouse off of the game. And I have to look at the signs. North and west. North and west. That one's already right. I got that one right. Totally knew it was supposed to be west, y'all. Totally knew. And they're fa they're facing away. Now. That was 100%. I already totally definitely knew that. Okay. <laughs> Ah! <sighs> 
Oh, that's... Oh, get off, get off. Bad. I'm not even gonna deal with them, because they're that insignificant. But no, I remember this. I remember this one. We are going back for healing items now. <laughs> I remember that one. Not this one. Although I knew it was to get them to face away. I just thought it was trial and error to get it. Nope. This game actually has, shockingly, game design. You know, unlike most games. Which don't. Oh. Let go. Bad dog. Bad dog. Bad dog. Grr. <laughs> okay, so. I know what to do here. I know what to do. Oh! That was not a part of the plan I had in mind. <laughs> All right, y'all. That happened. You know, I would pet the doggos, but once again, I don't think the doggos are there for the petting. I think the doggos are there for the angie. I think those doggos are very angie doggos. Um... Okay, first of all, let me... Let me consolidate my shotgun ammo. Because I kind of have a lot of it. We're gonna wanna bring that. I'm gonna bring that. And here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna reload the shotgun here. And then stash it stash the ammo away once more. Because in my head, it makes more sense to uh stash the ammo away in this case, <laughs> and not have it on me. I have a question. Would it... <laughs> okay, so, I know what to do here. I know what to do. Oh, fuck! That was not a... Part of the plan I had in mind. <laughs> Do I want to know what that clip is? I got distracted from my question. Andrew. Would it count as petting the doggo if I were to stab it with a knife? <laughs> ah, awesome. <laughs> Yeah, petting it with a knife, because I, there's not, there's not really a barehanded, like, motion in this game.
Hello. Not gonna deal with that right now. Probably gonna regret not dealing with that later. What just walked in? I'm going to get jumped again. Actually, maybe I won't. Um, where was I going? I was going this way. Gates open. Huh. <sighs> Those birds are scary. Right, so we're gonna hop over here. We're gonna put that in there. Take out the moon. Take out the sun. Nope. Flock off, feather face. Plus equals minus. Okay, so I believe... Or that. Or that would make my life a whole lot easier. So now we can pretty much just use them. It'll be fine. What do we get? Why was there a gun hidden in a in a gravestone? I don't know. But we get the Magnum revolver. Guaranteed to give you a headache. That was Resident Evil. Wow. Burp at the exact wrong moment. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> 